just tease that, you know, a lot of us have gotten a lot better. So I think we're a completely different team than we were the first time around. You know, they've been, they've proven to be human at times and been knocked off and, uh... Tried to make it such a Illinois versus Purdue thing. And all Purdue has done is like kept winning and, and won this league and hung banners and cut nets and done it at Illinois' expense. And here we are with Purdue getting a chance to put the nail in the coffin in Champaign. It's poetic, it's beautiful. Yeah, it's a put up or shut up moment for either side. Illinois, Purdue tomorrow night, who you got? Illinois at home. I kind of think that's where I'm at too. I think Illinois is going to be looking for some revenge. I think that the the size and athleticism Illinois guards are going to give Purdue a little bit of trouble. And I think the versatility of Coleman Hawkins to pull that can be away from the basket. I think Illinois wins this game 91 to 84. I'm all the way in. I think Illinois wins this game. Oh. I'm back on the bandwagon. I think Purdue's defense has really fallen. They've gotten really stagnant. The Illinois' defense is worse, don't get me wrong, but their offense is better. Yeah, I think Illinois wins this game. Is that crazy? <laughs> It is crazy. Purdue wins. I'm with you, Robbie. That's not <laughs> – he's not going for the ball. I, I think that that was message sent here. And Illinois trying to, to maybe establish some of that toughness, that physicality. Now he'll work one-on-one -on -one against Hawkins. He'll shoot, he'll score. Eddie down low against Hawkins, turns and dunks with authority. Okay, what's Coleman Hawkins going to do with it? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> exactly what we saw, right? Smith averaging nearly two steals per game leads the team. Already gets his hand in the cookie jar. Gillis hits the deck. Kick, corner, extra, knocked out of bounds. Well, how about the rotation there from Purdue? Zach Heaney quiets the crowd for the moment. Eight points for Zach. Smith bounces oh. it perfectly oh. delivered for Heaney. Braden Smith, his second assist, which now means he's the school's all-time leader. Like oh, play. Beautiful lob inside, and Edie with the easy slam. Six seconds left. Edie's in there, working on danger, and Edie gets it to go. And this firepower offensive exhibition lives up to the first 20 minutes. So you got to understand, good things are leading to that. We just got to finish that play, okay? When they take it away, he will find you, okay? But be ready to shoot that ball, okay? Be ready to shoot that basketball. Let's go. Pride, man. Pride, man. Don't feel what's on your chest. Family on three. One, two, three. Family. Illinois has made an adjustment. They're doubling that post, and Purdue is making them pay for it. He triple time. Oh, that feels good. That was good by Purdue right there. Hey, three, you handle that post double right there. You get out, you get Edie back. And Purdue, a nice defensive stop. Can't hit. Oh, the tip in. Cuff and run. They count it and a foul. As we say that. Oh, but what a block. Edie erases it. And it's stolen by Camden Heidi. Heidi stolen from Hawkins. Timeout on the floor. 11.40 to go in the game. Illinois 52, Purdue 51. Let's Just execute. Where it comes from, though, is we get it stopped. We got to load up then. This is a scramble. Just everybody scrambling. Who do I got? Whatever. No, I'm playing the ball. I'm reading. Good job. Blue with a two on one. Lance Jones in the left baseline. Gives the Gillis a three on the way. And Purdue has the lead for the first time tonight. Janet, give and go. Hawkins. Block. Great block. Edie. Oh, he stares him down. Now Smith's going to have to take it. And make it a big three for Braden Smith. Boy, you got a piece of that to pay, too. Gillis, another three. He's on target from downtown. A lawyer who wants to drive. Shoots a floater. Good. Five in a row from Fletcher Lawyer. Misses long. Rebounded by Braden Smith. It was tipped by Lawyer. Rebounded Braden Smith. Smith, hook inside. Knocked away. Edie's got it. Jones is open. Splash. Triple. No foul was called, and then popped out to Lawyer. Smith, five to shoot. A deep three. Oh! A triple time! What a shot! Braden Smith! Just hit him with the Steph Curry, night night, a lion eye. Illinois is not going to foul. Illinois is not going to foul. And the Purdue Boilermakers are going to come on the road and win at the State Farm Center and ruin Illinois' senior day. Back to back, outright Big Ten champ, the Boilermakers. Continue their dominance.